Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel, and we have a new version of Google Chrome browser, which is the most popular browser being used. So the Google Chrome browser now is in version 122, and it contains a few little new things. Um, first of all, to update, if you haven't checked, upper right corner, three vertical dots, help, and about Google Chrome. It'll be moved on to 122.0.6261.57 or 58, depending on Linux, on Mac OS, on Windows. Now, uh, the few little things that it has in there are, for example, in uh, certain markets like the United States, if you are into a page that has a form or anything that has a text box where you can write, if you right click, you will have an option for uh, some of you, not everybody, but some of you, like I said, the United States first, um, you'll have the option to get help in writing. It's AI uh, from Google that's getting there to say, well, you know, we want to help. You want, I, I can help you write if you want. So this could be a good and useful feature for some. Of course, there's a spell check and everything that's already there. Uh, there's a option also now that uh, the safe web um, feature of um, the Google Chrome browser is better. So now it is a lot more proactive and will warn you as it's downloading. It will go and fetch a website that you want to see. But if there's malware, known malware, or problems on that site, it will actually pop it up and say, no, there's known malware here. You shouldn't go there. So... Um, it's kind of, once again, a check as the website is downloading. And, of course, it will warn you before showing anything if there's a problem. There's a web GPU feature, which is rendering, of course, with your graphics adapter uh, for videos and uh, online games that are played in the browser, stuff like that. Anything that's intensive with graphics is improved to have better performance. And for the rest... 12 security updates. So if you don't really care about the new features, but you want to stay safe, update for the 12 security flaws that are fixed to high severity. The rest are medium and low severity. So just for that, it's already useful and important to update your browser so that you stay safe. This is your line of defense, your first line of defense, and nothing protects you from security flaws. Even your antivirus is useless against security flaws within software. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.